going on, Twin Tiers? And welcome to Twin Tiers Football, brought to you by Simmons Rockwell Ford. Well, it was a gorgeous Saturday for some high school and college football, but let's start off the show with one of the most anticipated games of the year, two defending Section 4 state champions going head-to-head. -head. The Tioga Tigers hosted the Waverly Wolverines under the lights, both teams suiting up for Military Appreciation Night. Waverly started out with a bang, second play of the night, Ben Shaw with a bullet downfield to Xavier Watson, what a catch from the UConn commit. That leads us to this next play. Shaw hands it off to Fletcher Good. Good to the outside, a clear path to the end zone, just inside the pylon, and he's good for the score. Tioga going on it on a huge fourth and 10 try. Jaden Duncanson feeds it over the middle to Dominic Palmer, and that's a good Tigers first down. Shaw to Colson Keithley on this one. The Wolverines operating with the lead tonight. They stay in the driver's seat the rest of the way. The defending Class D champs get their revenge over the defending Class D champs. 50 to 6, the final. To D3 now, Ithaca College hosting Rensselaer Polytechnic Institute this afternoon. Both teams coming off of wins last week. Starting off in the second quarter, Bombers up 10 to nothing. RPI getting on the board here. Caden White with a one yard run for six. I see with some tricks up their sleeves this afternoon. Matthew Parker to Jalen Osborne. J-Lo putting on the QB hat. Passes down deep to the field to a wide open Nick Matos. Bombers extending their lead 17 to 7. Ithaca defense on fire today again. Jake Kazanowski passes to his right and he's picked off by Danny Portis. What a reach by the defensive back. Nick Lang goes on to catch a 31 yard pass from Parker a few plays later and the Bombers maximizing and scoring on the turnover. Lang with another impressive catch in the third quarter, stumbling, but he finds his way. He finds his feet and he gets into the end zone for another Bomber touchdown. Ithaca College improves to three and three, 33 to 14, the final score. And to the scoreboard, the Ithaca Little Red got back in the win column this week. They edged out Newark Valley 18 to 16 this afternoon. And the Big Red got their first win in two weeks. Cornell getting the dub over Bucknell 34 to 21. And on the sprint football field, the Mansfield Mountaineers dropped to one and four on the year. The Mounties falling to Chestnut Hill 42 to 35.